Welcome to the Born's Current Sense Resistor Training Module. With the growth in demand for electronic applications such as controls, handheld devices, and energy efficiency, the requirements for current sense resistors as an effective means of measuring and controlling current also continue to grow. This training module is an introduction to the current sense resistor. Current sense resistors are very popular in power supplies, motor controls for various applications, battery-operated equipment, and energy meters and actuators in industrial, automotive, telecom, and medical markets. Although current measurement can be done using several sense methods such as resistive, inductive, and Hall effect sensors, some of which have the advantage of being fully isolated solutions, Current sense resistors still hold their own due to their relatively low cost, the simplicity of designing them in, and the reliability and accuracy offered. With the current sense resistors available from Borns, we cover a full range of requirements. We have the highest power and density available with the ability to design resistors in 1206 cases, CRF1206, with a constant current of 10 amperes, 100 millivolts, and 2512 cases, CRA2512, with a constant current of 17 amperes, or 170 millivolts. We can offer parts for very high constant current, such as models PWR4412, PWR4413 with a maximum current of 30 amperes, or PWR220 with a maximum current of 50 amperes. We offer very high accuracy, being able to provide TCRs as low as 15 parts per million in our PWR220-2S series, manganin foil resistors between 20 degrees Celsius and 60 degrees Celsius, and 75 parts per million in our CRA2512, CRA2010, CRF2512, CRF1206 stamped metal alloy current sense resistors. The TCR of a current sense resistor depends on its resistance value and the resistive technology. This is why there is variation, tan bar, in TCR shown on the product selection guide. For application requiring a high operating temperature, our PWR4412 is derated to 0 watts at 325 degrees Celsius ambient temperature, while CRA2512 is derated to 0 watts at 170 degrees Celsius. Having such high operating temperatures allows designers to run the component at less than 100% power over a much wider operating temperature. It is important for an engineer to know how large the solder pad should be on a circuit board, especially when designing in SMD resistor for high current. Typically, using a total surface area as outlined in the matrix, the surface temperature of the model shown should not exceed typically 90 degrees Celsius with an initial ambient temperature of 25 degrees Celsius. If the environmental temperature is higher than ambient, then how hot will the CRA series get under power? The matrix shows actual recorded temperatures of a resistor, which is rated to 3 watts maximum when powered to just 30%. At 85 degrees Celsius, the temperature of the part rises to 101 degrees Celsius. For designers who require small SMD current sense resistors with a power rating of 1 watt and temperature derating starting from 80 degrees Celsius, the CRA2512 is a good solution. The most effective and accurate way to measure the resistance of a low ohmic resistor is to use a four-wire measurement method. This is particularly true at very low ohmic values. The accuracy of the voltage measurement could be affected by the current drop through the input and output terminals. Using separate terminals for the current and voltage minimizes this. Borns recommends the pad layout shown for models CRF2512 and CRA2512. All models of the PWR220 or PWR263 series, whether thick film or manganin foil technology, are able to dissipate high amounts of power and carry up to 50 amps of current, provided there is a sufficient thermal path between the resistor, its backplate, and the mounting surface. The larger the heat sink that the resistor can attach to, the lower the overall thermal resistance and the higher the amount of current that can be carried. The most important condition for operating this range of resistors is to keep the temperature of the backplate at 25 degrees Celsius under power. The maximum surface temperature of the resistor typically should be 155 degrees Celsius. 
Born's models PWR4412 and PWR4413 are designed for a wide range of environments where the ambient temperature could get quite hot and where very high continuous currents are required to be measured. They have the advantage of being very robust and capable of withstanding large inrushes of current. This chart shows the maximum inrush currents that the parts can safely withstand. Born's PWR4412 and PWR4413 series consist of low ohmic wire with a TCR of plus or minus 20 parts per million, which is formed, cut, and welded to tin-plated copper terminations. The terminations are 1 mm in diameter and can carry up to 78 amps in current. To ensure accurate measurements, it is important to make measurements from the designated measurement points. Born's current sense resistors provide a maximum current capability of 50 amps. Packaging types available are SMD, open frame, and TO220 housings. Temperature coefficients as low as plus or minus 15 parts per million and operating temperatures as high as 325 degrees Celsius are also available. For information on Born's design kits, data sheets, and application notes, please visit our website at www.borns.com.